update. We are also leading the way on another break, break, major breaking news story this morning. An arrest warrant issued for Cincinnati Bengals star running back Joe Mixon. Yeah, I saw the tweets before we were going to bed about this right. uh, bubbling up last night. He's accused of pointing a gun at a victim while threatening them and now faces misdemeanor aggravated menacing charges. One charge. Records show it happened at the intersection of 3rd and Walnut just hours before the Bengals left for Buffalo to face the Bills last month. And that's where we find WLWT News 5's Meredith Stutz leading the way with what the documents show, reaction from the team, and also what Mixon's agent is saying. Good morning to you, Stephen and Kelly. Thank you. So that charge comes weeks after accusations and also right after the team just got home in the AFC Championship game. Now, according to court documents, that incident allegedly took place behind me here at 3rd and Walnut. But this is not the first time that Mixon has run in with the law. And we want to give you a warning ahead of time. We're going to show you some video from an incident that you may find disturbing. First, let's get back to that present day accusation because we want to show you that affidavit. Because according to it, Mixon allegedly pointed a firearm at a victim's stating, quote, you should be popped in the face. I should shoot you. The police can't get me. And the warrant says he's being charged with aggravated menacing, a first-degree misdemeanor. Now back to Mixon's criminal history and that disturbing video. In 2014, he was captured on surveillance video hitting a woman inside of a restaurant while he played football for the University of Oklahoma. He pled guilty to those charges, underwent community service, and did not serve jail time. But now he's accused in this separate incident. Last night, Mixon's agent, Peter Schaefer, told us this is a rush to judgment, issuing a statement saying in part, quote, they're dropping the charges first thing in the morning. I really feel that the police have an obligation before they file charges because of the damage that can be done to the person's reputation to do their work. Also in a statement sent to WLWT, the Bengals tell us, quote, the club is aware misdemeanor charges have been raised against Joe Mixon. The club is investigating the situation and will not comment further at this time. Now, be clear, so far Joe Mixon has not been arrested. WLWT has reached out directly to Mixon and has not heard back from it yet, from him yet. We also do want to be clear that so far that charge against Mixon has not yet been dropped. Reporting live, Meredith Seth, WLWT News 5. Thank you so much.